Super Bowl coverage does continue while Mike and Philip are still on the road through those Rocky Mountains. Isaac Petcash and John Leidick have been in Las Vegas all week, so let's check in with them today. Amanda, welcome back in here as we continue our coverage from the big game throughout this week. Plenty of good stuff, including the NFL honors coming up tonight. There's going to be a lot of top awards handed out, but one prestigious one that really captures the hearts of the player. Yeah, outside of the Lombardi Trophy, the Walter Payton Man of the Year Award is what everybody wants to win because it shows that humanitarian side of the players. David Njoku, the nominee for the Browns, Cam Hayward for the Steelers and for the Bills. It's Deion Dawkins, second year in a row that he's been nominated for the award. Caught up with him yesterday at the Play 60 event, John, and asked him what it would mean to be able to have this under his grasp and to be able to show that his humanitarian side is deserving of this award. Here's what he had to say. It will mean everything, man. Uh, to get an award for for showing my at my true heart is true, you know, because your heart is on the inside, but you wear it on the outside. And for people on the outside to connect with it the organic way, uh, it, it's everything. Because, like, as an athlete for playing, like, many years, like, but like you get it, like but like you get the money, but you get the fame, but you get it all. But with something like this, it can't be bought and it can't be fake. So uh, this will definitely show everybody from back home on the East Coast, definitely Jersey, even like Buffalo, that um, you can do whatever you choose to. Now also coming out tonight, the Pro Football Hall of Fame class, plus more NFL honors, TJ Watt, Miles Garrett, headlining who could be the defensive player of the year, John. Yeah, we'll find out which five members of the 15 semifinalists will be named to the 2024 Pro Football Hall of Fame class that will be enshrined in early August in Canton, Ohio. Our Road to Vegas coverage continues later today. We'll have much more as we hear from the San Francisco 49ers, plus action from all and around Las Vegas. For Isaac Petcash, I'm John Laddick on the Road to Vegas.